All right, a thousand dollar par value bond matures in four years, pays thirty-seven dollars of interest every six months, has a price of a thousand sixty-five. What's the bond yield to maturity, current yield, and capital gains yield? All right, if it pays thirty-seven dollars every six months for four years, that'll be four years with two payments a year. So it's a semi-annual bond. It costs thousand sixty-five dollars. has a par value of a thousand. All right. So since it has semi-annual payments in semi-annual periods, we'll get a semi-annual interest rate. All right. So the rate Open the dialog box, it goes number of periods, payment, present value, future value. And when we solve for that, what I have is a semi-annual interest rate. Now I want the yield to maturity, so to multiply by 2 to convert that to an annual number, and that's the yield to maturity. The current yield is defined as annual cash flow divided by current price. So that would be equal to $37 twice a year, $74, divided by $1,065. And that's your current yield. That's the cash flow yield, the capital gains yield is simply equal to the yield to maturity minus the current yield. And it's a negative capital gains yield because we know as the bond matures, the price will drop from $1,065 to $1,000 holding all else constant.